Welcome back heroes to some more Pokemon Floral Tempest. Last episode we explored Izora Island, had to find the gym leader in the cabins. Um, Faye came along too because Faye has a massive crush on the gym leader. But inside the caverns, Team Blight has set up a little base where they were keeping the kidnapped children and Dory was actually there. Not anymore though, she's been taken away to a different facility, but luckily she left a note telling us where she was. So we can go and uh, chase after her in a little bit. But we're gonna get the second gym badge today. And unfortunately, um, I actually tried to record this episode and uh, I was battling Faye and she's pretty tough. And while I was grinding, my game crashed. So I have to probably redo a lot of stuff. But looking at the team, here we go. So we got, you guys asked me to keep Riolu on the team. So he's gonna stay on the team because it'd be really nice to get the boosted XP because they gift Pokemon. Uh, we need to take XP share off you because we can do something. So the funny thing is I'm playing like um, a few different Pokemon games right now in my own time and because they're not generation, you know, not generation 6 plus and the fairy type doesn't exist, when Eevee went to learn Charm, I was like, oh it's a normal type move, didn't think about it and just like uh, didn't teach it to Eevee and obviously as I want a Sylveon, teaching a fairy type move to uh, Eevee is what we need to do but fortunately in this game we have common candy which I can just use to uh, bring Eevee down to level 28, then once it grows a level 29, it learns Charm, which will teach it to Eevee, then we can get Sylveon, which will be really nice, but this battle coming up is very, very difficult, so I'm um, gonna try and do it first try, because I've got a little strategy, but can't guarantee it's gonna work. Also, we need to give the Soothe Bell to Riolu, or oh, in Fit Club to, um, Alpha, because that would definitely help. Alright, Sue Bell, where you at? We need it. There you go. That will help us get Lucario a little bit faster. And anything else we can put on people. Could always put this onto Blink to extend light screen. Uh, May Flinch. That Flinch could actually come handy, but Quick Claw is probably something I need more. Uh, actually not on you. Quick claw on boss. Right, let's, um, oh, maybe a focus sash actually could help. Because the extra drill, extra drill is kind of difficult to beat and so is the haunch crow. But, um, we'll give this a go first. So let's go talk to Faye. Hey, Boltsy. I'm pretty sure you know why I'm standing out here blocking the entrance to the gym. It's because she wants to fight. I want to battle you. I want to test myself before challenging this gym. I would ask Del. But I don't feel like going to the cave again to search for him. Give it your all, Voltsy. I will try. But uh, I'm not going to lie, right now my team needs a little bit of grinding. And it was getting there until the game crashed. Which was kind of annoying. I I think I know why it crashed. Oh, I kind of think I know why it crashed. Um, basically, it can rain this island. And I walked I walked out of the Pokemon Center and started raining. I walked back in, walked back out. It's still raining, walked back in, walked back out. Still raining, walked back in, and it was like, oh, they tried to play like two sounds at once and it crashed the game. I was like, oh, great. Because <laughs> if it's raining, then our um, Marowak can't do much here, but yes. Waste the potions when the cop. Waste them now. This will be good. If it can live, this will be great for us. Nope, it's fine. I think she has three super potions she uses, so getting rid of one right now is pretty good. Right, this Haunch Crow can do a lot of damage and it has Moxie as well, so. And I hope you go for Sucker Punch, and we're going to go for Will-O-Wisp. Yes! Perfect. Land, land, land. Nice! Perfect, perfect start for us. Right. There's a few things we can do. I'm going to go for a Flame Wheel. Okay, Sucker Punch. We should live. Just about. Good. Oh, that is a nice crit, actually. 100% she's going to heal up. So we're going to go for another flame wheel. There we go. Nice. Oh, I think we kill it now, actually. I was going to heal up, but I'll heal up in a little bit. Sweet. Okay, that's this level 39. Next, the extra drill is probably coming out. Charm. Yep, and we want to learn charm. <laughs> so we can actually get Sylveon. Nice. Right. What to do against this bad boy? This is where I've been struggling a little bit. Uh, you'd think it's just Hanzo and Razor Leaf it, but if it goes for Swords Dance, Iron Head can kill me in one hit. If it just goes straight for um, Iron Head, he can almost kill me. 
so it's uh, not looking good. Let's go for Razor Leaf. Ow. Did a lot of damage, as you can see. And we don't do too much. I'm going to go for a Sucker Punch. Because we're probably going to die here. Yep, it's fine. Uh, what we want to do next is try and just get as much damage off as possible. So I'm going to go into Kurama. Just do a little bit of damage. Not much, but every little helps right now, to be honest. It's all good. I don't think we can outspeed it with boss. He, he knows Rock Slide as well. We can fake fake out. I think we can probably live one attack. And if the Shadow Ball can finish it off, then we are... We're good. Just scared she might go for a potion. I hope not. Oh, there's the potion. Great. We need, we need the special defense drop here. That's actually perfect. We might be able to finish you off. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, it's fine. We can probably live this. Just about. All right, Shadow Ball. Right, got Cypher and Gardevoir left. Alrighty then. Uh, Cypher, we're going to go into... Ready, go. I didn't name the Riolo Rico, by the way, because it's um, that kid who was uh, trapped or kidnapped by Team Blight. We are going to go for a potion onto Alpha. It was super dead. <laughs> if we lived that, that would have been so nice, but that ain't going to happen. Right, one flame wheel might be able to finish you off, Cypher. Kind of hope. Oh, we're probably dead from knockoff. <gasps> one HP! Oh my god! That's just not enough damage, though. That's the problem. So I'm gonna... Push it. We're gonna die. Although... We curse bodied the um, knockoff, didn't we? So we might be able to live. This is risky. This is not enough HP back. I can keep trying. If we miss an attack or something, we could be good. No longer disabled. Okay, now we're gonna die. Knockoff's coming in. It was worth a little shot. Unfortunately, it did not work. Probably would have been best to heal up um thingy first, but it's all good. Right, we fake out the cipher. We have a Shadow Baller, don't we? Oh, what? Okay, it's fine. Uh, you can outspeed me anyway. You turn. Oh, we are so dead. Yep. This is bad. This is bad. We might... There's still a chance we can do this. If not, we just have to do a little bit of grinding. But if Boss can get the stat boost from Silverwind here... My quick claw actually coming in clutch. Oh wow, that did like... That did nothing. I honestly thought we would probably almost kill it. But, anyway. At least we're going to get a Sylveon. Which is nice. Hey. Alright, so I'm going to go back to grinding. And I'm going to save it consistently this time. So we don't uh, crash the game, because that sucks. But we got a Sylveon, yay! Our team's actually looking really good. Oh, Misty Terrain, um... Uh, yeah, let's get rid of Bite. Not sure it's gonna help too much, but it might. Right, yeah, so I'll see you guys 
back when we were about to beat Faye, because this is going to take a little while. All right, so we're back on the Cypher. Extra Drill is still alive, and so is the Gardevoir. But really like we can do this. Knock off, out, does a lot of damage. As the Fling Wheel do a lot to the Cypher. Oh, we got the burn! Oh my god, that burn was actually so clutch. That burn might just won us the battle really, really easy. Just gonna quickly heal up. Yeah, we can take another knock off. Oh, dude, the burn has just been saving us so much. Woo! Alright, so. Another flame wheel. Yeah, cool, we can take another knock off. It's all good. Curse body, it doesn't really matter. See your cipher. Alright, two left. We can do this. Alright, the extra draw is the thing that's going to be the hardest thing to beat. Please, Hanzo, if you want to give me like a crit on the Razor Leaf. Like, the moment we learn like Leaf Blade or something, it becomes so much easier. Like, the problem is, I want to go, just go for Sucker Punch, because it seems like it does more damage than Razor Leaf, but... Should we try a Spirit Shackle? It's risky. I'm going to... Mm, I'm going to risk it, because Razor Leaf does not do much at all. Oh, oh, wow. Yeah, that's so much more damage than everything. Perfect, alright. Please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me! Nice, and Sucker Punch finishes it off. Woo, let's go! Lucky us. Oh man, this is... It's been a hard battle, but I think we win now. Right, uh, Gardevoir, we can... Let's stay in. Just to get off a, uh, Sucker Punch. Nice. Plus, this is where God of All goes for like Calm Mind, Calm Mind, Calm Mind, and absolutely wrecks me. <laughs> oh, can you imagine? That would be disastrous. It really would. Uh, gonna go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I went into um, Riolu against the Haunch Crow. I went for Sucker Punch, obviously, and hit me. And then I went for Endure, and then let it, um, Riolu win. I got 20. I got, I got like 13 levels from winning. Crazy. Right, uh, let's go. I kind of want to go into boss. We know it didn't do too much damage last time, but I want to go for. Honestly, I thought Bug Buzz was a physical. <laughs> this is bad. It's fine. It's got air cutter. I don't know if I do any more damage than last time or not. I I'm sorry, beautiful. I tried to get you some XP. It did not go down well. That's fine. We, we can still. Easily win. Fake out, Shadow Ball, job done. Ain't worried at all. Unless it, you know, ends up doing something very scary and then I'm, I'm a little bit scared. Yeah, one more Shadow Ball, we win. Moonblast shouldn't kill us. <sighs> yeah, Moonblast shouldn't kill us, almost kills us. Oh my goodness, that was a lot of damage. And win. There we go. Man, Faye was pretty difficult. I mean, if we had Sylvia on level 40 and then we had Lucario level 40, we would, it would have been a lot easier. But despite losing, I still feel like I'm not that far behind you yet. <laughs> I'm going to go train it some more, but I'm definitely going to take on Milo with everything I've got. See you, Voltsy. Not if I see you first. All right, let's quickly save the game. I just do not want this game crashing on me again. All right, let's go get healed up. And then we can take on Milo. And I feel like, I don't know, I feel like either we beat Milo super easy or we're going to have to do a lot of grinding. Either way, I'm not looking forward to this battle. <laughs> oh, man. All right. I'm going to give it everything i got, though. Let's let's hope we can we can do it. We've got some trainers about as well, so it should be pretty nice. And we'll lead off with not Alpha. You're pretty useless in this battle, to be fair. Uh, we got we got boss with Giga Drain. Let's try to train him up a little bit. Okay, yo. Are you strong enough to take on Milo? I, I hope so. I mean, we'll see. Lombre! We are going to go for an air cutter. Oh, in the Pokemon Center. Um, just, you know, I went to the Pokemon Center in London over the weekend. That's why it hasn't been many, like, 
Flora Tempest uploads because I didn't have a chance to record it. Oh, it was it was a long, horrible experience. But inside the store was nice. That's all I'll say. Um, anyway, there was a Detective Pikachu Ludicolo plush. And unfortunately, because of scalpers, they put a limit on how much you can buy. And I was planning on buying it because I saw it in a, in a video. I was like, oh, this looks so amazing. I wanted to get it. And then I was like, I couldn't because there was too much stuff I was buying. But man, if, I, if there was no limit, I would have bought it. Unfortunately, if you look on eBay, there's so many scalpers out there just like bought all the exclusive stuff just selling on eBay for a ridiculous amount of money. And I would I would not recommend buying anything from a scalper unless you really, really want it and it's sold out. Like right now, there's some of the Detective Pikachu, not Detective Pikachu, London Pikachu plushes. Oh, okay, Jim changed. Yeah, London Pikachu plushes for like they're 20 pounds in the Pokemon Center and they're still like over three weeks left to go and get one but if you're in the UK and then obviously free it, it closes and they you can't get one you really want one then you probably have to buy it but just ah man the scalpers suck so much they really do like how can how can you buy something for 20 pound and sell on eBay for like 500 pound and like you know everyone wants it and you're just taking up stock because you're just selfish and greedy it's just so annoying like ah, I, I I'm not going to call them out, but when I was looking at all the uh, the details of the Pokemon Center on the first day it opened, there was someone on Twitter going like, oh, I'm the first person in and stuff. I was like, oh, cool. That's nice. And then the second day, they were there again, one of the first people in. I was like, oh, did you not get anything you want on the first day? And then they were there the third day as well, one of the first people in. I was like, I wonder why you're always the first person in there, hmm? I wonder if it's maybe you're buying more stock to sell on eBay. Oh, scumbags, man. Scumbags. Just annoying. It's just annoying, because, like, if it wasn't for them, there probably wouldn't be any limit, and I could have got the stuff I wanted. I mean, I got, I got everything I... I said everything. I got almost everything I wanted. I got the main stuff I wanted, like, all the... I wanted the uh, the little... the water bottle that looks so cool. Couldn't get it. Because the limit, and it was sold out. <laughs> just people suck, though. Like, I think the Pokemon that was cool, it's just the people... Like, people ruined it. That's probably the best way to put it. Oh, man. All right, uh, it's gonna raise a leaf. We are taking so much damage. The problem is we're just so slow. The moment we can, like, you know, get speed, which is probably not gonna happen with, like, Decidueye. <laughs> we can start winning easy. Uh, let's go Fake Out, and then we'll go Psychic. If you're in the UK and you plan to go, my... My advice right now, depends like what's going to happen in the future, is you need to get there, like at the shopping center, before 7 a.m. It doesn't open till 10 a.m., but you need to get there before 7, or you won't get in, or things will sell out. That is, yeah, that's my advice. Like, I, I got there at 6 a.m. It was a long, long day. I'm going to quickly leave and go and heal up. But, yeah. Funny thing is, like, I wanted to scream, there's people in the line next to me, and they're like, oh, it's really annoying, like, I just want to get in there and buy one thing. I'm like, you want one thing? You've been lining up for, like, 12 hours, and you want one thing? Bro, I've been lining up 12 hours, and I want everything in there. <laughs> and I know everyone's got, like, a budget and stuff, but it's just, it's just crazy people will line up for, like, one thing. Like, if I wanted just one thing in there, 12 hours, I would probably just find a friend that was going, maybe try and get them, get, get them to get me or something, just... I, I, couldn't, I wouldn't line up 12 hours for one thing. Couldn't do it. But a bunch of things, oh yeah, you better believe I would. <laughs> oh man. Can you body that okay? Eh! Uh, oh, you got the paralysis? That really sucks. Speaking of, like, Gastron right there, speaking of Gastron, like, um, when I was in London, the, the split for Pokemon Go for Gastrodon or Shellos is like, you know, the pink and the blue. It's split right down the middle of the UK. So where I live, I can get the pink one. And when I was in uh, at the Pokemon Center for London, it was the split for the blue one. And I, I, I couldn't find a Shellos because on top of the shopping center, they had like a little Pokemon Center event for Pokemon Go going on. It wasn't anything special. It was just like Eevee, Jolteon, Flareon, Vaporeon spawning. But anyway, it's just like, dude, I want a, I want a blue Shellos. Couldn't find one. But luckily I'm going back to London. Uh, this weekend coming up, so I can maybe get one then. Oof. 
Not bad. This boss actually doing quite well in here. This gym might be a little bit easy for us because we've got Giga Drain and Decidueye with Razor Leaf. Just sucks we don't have Leaf Blade. Oh, okay. I almost forgot what a Scrub was. I was like, what's a Scrub? That's a Poison Water dude. But yeah, it's Poison Water now, then he goes to Poison Dragon. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna go for Giga Drain. Might be the best. Wait, what? Do Quick Claw not let us go first? I know we're paralyzed, but I thought it still should go first, but okay. It's fine. Just keep Giga Draining, and then I think we'll be alright. Up and kill. Ah! Live! And one more Giga Drain. Ah! Oh, that sucks. But the biggest problem with the Pokemon Center, for like, every for, for Europe as a whole, is like, if you're in the US, you're lucky, she got the online store, and there's so much stuff I would buy off there all the time. And then if you're in Japan, you got, you got like free Pokemon Centers, so you're, you're quite lucky, and you probably have an online store as well, I wouldn't be surprised. But Europe has nothing. Europe has, apparently there was like a Pokemon Center in like Paris, like a couple of years ago, I don't remember that at all, but apparently that like was really, really bad, and they sold out of like all their stock within like three or four days. And then, um, yeah, the one in London right now is going on. Like, to me, I think what they should have done is gone like, okay, we have, in an hour, we can fit 100 people in. So you need to on online buy a, a ticket, like, hour slots for the whole week. One per, like, email address or something. That would have been nice. That way everyone could have, like, easily got in. Stock wouldn't have been depleted so fast. But, yeah. It doesn't create hype and urgency, does it? Hype and urgency, that's how you sell product. You hype it up. Yeah, you have limited supplies and stuff, and it can sell out fast, so it gets people going to get everything, and just, yeah. Hype and urgency. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, let's go, boss. Almost level 40 as well. And Kuruma 34. Once, I'm hoping, once Kuruma gets to 40, we'll put XP share on Riolu, and then the amount of steps and battles we've won with Riolu with the Soothe Bell would be enough to maybe get a Lucario. We'll see. And last one is a Kabuto. There's a lot of like water rock types in here, which is which is really good for us. If the if the gym leader has like a water rock team, like those are fossils, we are just gonna absolutely wreck. Or like even water ground. Like what I would say one of my least favorite type combinations are um, Pokemon that are like four times weak to grass. I feel like there's a lot of grass Pokemon in Pokemon and just Yeah. Oh, you're a Gyarados. That's gonna be an issue but we can give it our best shot I would have come up with some elaborate puzzle and get your mind worked up before battle but I think you've been for enough today I can't say thank you enough for helping me out in the caves imagine if I was there alone anyway I hope you're ready it's time to show me what you got it's time to crash waves down on this place it's time to bring the heat you've been saving up all this time Show me what you got. All right, got a Pelipper. Okay, she's got two water flying types. That's kind of annoying. I don't know what to do. If I'm being completely honest, I feel like this thing's gonna kill me. I'm gonna go into Blink. Set up a light screen. Oh my god. We are so dead. Okay. Oh, and that burn. You would get the burn, bro. I just gotta attack and just go from there. Except I'm trying to heal up because I'm just gonna keep dying. Alright, so oh, critical hit, okay. If we lose this battle, we come back, we lead off a blink, everything will be fine. Uh, let's go Kuruma, maybe finish you off. Would Misty Trink get rid of the rain dance? Well, the drizzle, you know, the rain. I'm gonna give it a go. A Hyper Potion? Oh, you suck. I'll bet on, bet on this and the Gyarados, I guess. 
No, the race days are okay. I'm just gonna double check. Let's try a fairy wind. Not much damage. How much to return do? As long as he doesn't get the confusion on me, we should be fine. I don't like nothing. I need confusion. At least I know for next time though. The rain stop. Oh, perfect. Okay. Uh, he might know rain dance. I got no potion. I got one potion. I need to save. Yeah, we're probably losing this battle. It's fine. When that pepper comes back out, he is so going to get the rain up. This is bad. At least we like we've got a strategy for next turn. Like, we know what to do. Uh, this is fine. It's going to you. I think probably Spirit Shackle would be better because like the extra deal ate the Razor Leaf, but Spirit Shackle is pretty good. Just don't burn me. So this is good. This is good. The Outspeeder, which is crazy as well. On the wave, okay. If we go for a Sucker Punch, you might Hyper Potion up actually. To be fair, I'm not gonna risk the Sucker Punch. Yeah. Thought so. These hyper potions, man, so annoying. I can't even buy hypers. I think I'll do one more spirit shackle and then I might get rid of the paralysis, hoping that you'll call this Kashi her. Oh, or not. Okay. This is fine. Actually, kind of tanking hits pretty well. Oh, he can't burn me because I'm paralyzed. Great. Yeah, we need more potions, though, 100% for this battle. Right. Time to... Say goodbye. <laughs> right, let's heal up. And... It's fine. I'll just keep the paralysis. It's annoying, but... What are we gonna do? Thunderbolt, okay. Finish it off, finish it off. Nice, all right. Pelipper coming out. Uh, we know Hurricane will probably kill me. Scold will kill me. I just have to go for Sucker Punch. Not much I can do. We're gonna lose this battle, but it's fine. At least we've got the strategy for next time. So good. I think we'll just like, yeah, start this battle again because we're not going to win this. And we'll come back in with our strategy and then we'll hopefully do a lot better and win. I'll see you guys in a second.
We have done it. Three hours. Okay, I'm just going to um, slowly go through this because the game has crashed on me so many times. So many times it crashed. Skull's really good. Just don't, just don't crash on me. Just don't game. Please don't crash on me. Please don't crash on me. Please don't crash on me. I don't care what you're saying. Okay, we're good. I spent three hours on that, maybe even more than three hours? Yeah, three hours on that gym battle. It was ridiculous. The amount of times I got joked. Finally did it. Almost gave up playing this game because that gym battle was extremely difficult. And the more I grinded, like I grinded, um, you know, Sylveon to 40, got Riolu to 39, and then their levels went from 39 and 40 to 41, 42. And it got harder and harder and harder. And I eventually did it, as you saw. And I have no idea how long this episode is. But I'm going to end this part here. Because I just, I can't play this game. Oh, I'm going to continue the series, don't worry. I'm not, I just can't play this game anymore right now. Because I spent over three hours doing that. And I am mentally drained, mentally scarred. And I just, I am just don't want to ever do that again. Because it was horrendous. Big up. Big up boss for being an absolute boss. And luckily the you know it got out of the freeze first turn. Oh my god. If he didn't outspeed the Gyarados, we probably still lose we, we yeah, we lose that and you obviously we don't get through here, but Oh my god. That was annoying. So annoying. I need to try and get Lucario as well. Like, I, I left at level 39 and I was thinking I'm going to run around and try and get Lucario. But even if I got Lucario, it didn't matter too much because the Gyarados knew Earthquake and the Gastron had Earth Power. So even if I had Lucario, it wouldn't it wouldn't have helped because it would have just died right away. But in the end, we did it. I'm happy. I'm still currently sad and stressed from before. But thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great day. Peace.